It has been crossing the waters of Lake Michigan since 1953, the largest car ferry ever to sail on the Big Lake. The SS Badger ferries passengers and cargo from Ludington to the spring to the fall every year. Mm -hmm. Sounds fantastic. And today, Terry Brown from the SS Badger is here to tell us all about the steamship and, of course, about a great special they have going on. So tell us about the SS Badger. Uh, thank you first for inviting us to, to be here. Um, the SS Badger is um, an historic coal-fired steamship that travels from Ludington to Manitowoc. Um, and we are currently in our double season, which um, will change in uh, September, and then we'll go back to single sailings at that time. Um, great fun aboard the ship. We love seeing all new faces all the time. Yeah, so tell us a little bit about the experience itself, Terry. How long does it take to go one way? What's available on the um, vessel? It's a four hour cruise across the lake and um, once on board ship we have a ton of amenities to keep um, individuals of all ages very active. We have Badger Bingo, they do that in 90 minute segments and we have cheesy jokes that everyone either laughs or boos at, which yeah. we welcome. Um, we have a kids playroom, we have an arcade, we have two dining areas, there's low cost Wi-Fi, there's a movie theater, a museum, it's just a oh large, large vessel with lots of things for all ages to uh, keep busy with. And the great thing is you get to take your car along with you. Exactly. Or your RV, mm -hmm. your semi. Um, it used to, as you know, haul um, train cars. So we have a lot of our passengers that are still excited to see that the tracks are still within the base <laughs> of the car ferry. So that brings them back um, some to the historic significance of the vessel itself. Yeah. Let's look more at the advantage of taking our vehicles with us because we know we have another option and that's driving around the lake. Yeah. And so if you decide to go, what's the advantage to doing the SS Badger as opposed to just, you know, hitting the road and doing it that way? Well, there's the, the main advantage is that you're, you're getting to your destination in significantly less time while you're enjoying yourself. The kids are active. They're not sitting in the back seat of the car getting fidgety and antsy. Um, we keep them busy and you're, at your, as I said, a, an abbreviated journey across the lake while making friends and fun memories. I bet that the just that part of the journey is a huge part of the experience. I mean, you may even have families who take the trip across, maybe spend a night or two in the hotel and come back and think that they've had exactly. a, a terrific summer vacation. Exactly. It's, it it's a very relaxing journey across. And as I said, there are so many things to do. Um, when the family gets to the other side, there's um, a zoo that they can go visit with. The Wisconsin Maritime Museum is right there near the dock where we um, disembark and so even if you're just over there for an evening or a day there's so many activities that on that site too all all age groups can mm -hmm. participate in right they can board the vessel again and and be back in Ludington within a 24-hour period that's really neat the history I and mean, we, we touched upon that a little bit and you had said the train cars yes. used to go on that way yes it's really interesting and I guess it really speaks to how much our lives have changed right because you know everyone pretty much has a car now that use for transportation, you know, whether we're talking about transporting people or items, has changed a lot, and people would really learn a little bit about that. Yeah, and the museum aboard the, aboard the ship shows the significance of the vessel and the history that it's gone through, and um, I think that the passengers may not have known that mm -hmm. initially, but once they've reviewed our marketing materials, our historic um, materials, and spend some time, I think they walk away taking a little bit more um, appreciation for the journey that they've just had. Yeah. What's the capacity like on the ship, and how far in advance do you suggest people book their travel? Are you really pretty much able to accommodate people? Yeah, as I've been saying, it's a large vessel. We can, um, we have 600 that can travel with us um, and we can hold 180 vehicles on um, combination of semis, trailers, motorcycles, cars. And um, depending on when you want to have your journey, we suggest that you always call several days in advance. Um, but because we are sailing doubles, if you're really strict on, a, on uh, 
particular sailing date, we can pretty much meet your schedule as you know as long as we're given several days notice. Yeah. So we talked about history and we talked about some of the advantages and convenience. So let's turn to price because we know that gas prices are pretty high. Right. They're changing, especially as we get close to holidays and such. How much would it cost for a couple of adults with a vehicle? We have a special going right now that it's two adults and a vehicle one way for only $199. Wow. wow. And um, we've been having some great success with that this month. And um, I, again, it's a wonderful way to, to get to your destination, avoiding all the congestion and highway sure. and, and perhaps traffic delays. <clears throat> Excuse me. So and what a great cool. opportunity, too, for people maybe who never have had a chance to even set sail on the big lake. Crossing a great lake is really quite a remarkable opportunity. We've actually had passengers that say, you can't see the other side. Yeah. So they have no idea of the vastness of the Great Lakes. And um, so it's kind of fun to watch them and listen to their kids ask questions yeah. who had no idea it was like being in, in the ocean. Yeah. What we a great that experience. Quite a bit. Huh? Yeah. That's yeah. wonderful. Perfect. Terry, thanks for coming in. This is a Thank really Thank you. I really action. appreciate it your time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We'll be right back. This is 8 West.